Hello, hello everybody, and welcome back to more ReChef Upgrade. It's me, Cooper, and today we are going to uh, enjoy the fact that we defeated Panic in the last episode, and we're going to go to Grandpa. Buy cards indeed. So, Gramps, I'm gonna... Ooh, Swamp Battle Guard's on sale now. That's pretty cool. What, uh, what, is your effect just you and Lava? That makes sense. Alright. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, let's go ahead and let's go buy Attack. So, something I want to do... Oh, that's expensive. Uh, something I want to do is I want to use some monsters, that's insanely expensive, that are good and have good effects and are... Po okay, this is, this is something I can afford. A holy soul that powers down all monsters on the foe's field by 500 attack and defense while it remains on its own field. Why would I not buy that? That's amazing. Alright. Curse of Dragon, what about you? It turns Wasteland. Okay, I don't really have a Wasteland deck yet. I mean, I do have some machines, but... Yeah. Not exactly what we need. The Doku Rider. He has to be Wasteland-based too, right? <laughs> Forms a Wasteland as it should. I like that quite a lot. Exodia Necros. That's outrageous. So as long as Exodia is in the graveyard, he can exist. Musician King, I've been summoning you lately. Um, is there anything else? There's Lava Battle Guard, so if I wanted the combo, I could go for it. I'm not going to go for it. Spirit of the Books is good, but I'm not using that right now. Trap Remover is not terrible. Troop Dragon got a buff in this game. That's a huge buff. That's, that's insanity. All right, Exodia, Catapult Turtle, more Dorons. I'm fine with that. I'm, I'm looking more for tactical cards or cards that are just good in general. Some of our opponents are getting stronger, so maybe a better trap card would be good, but they're expensive. Oh my god. They are expensive. I'll buy one, and then with my last thousand dollars, I'll just chill. All right. Well, now that we've done that, we're going to go to our deck as we do in every early episode, and we make some changes. So, changes I am willing to make. I am going to make... Let's see. Honestly, I'm taking out some gigabytes. I wish they did better. It's just that I can't get the combo off enough. Because I have no evil searchers. I need evil searchers. That is my weakness. I don't mind having a gigabyte, though. They're low cost and they're fun guys. Good to have around. I could also just get more evil cards, but that's expensive. All right, let's go to attack. It's not that expensive. It's just not something I want to do. Move to the deck because we have a lot of multipliers. I was thinking about getting some more. Um, Dungeon Worm's not terrible, honestly. I have to go for something kind of low cost, though. Something kind of low cost. I can't even afford the new trap I just bought. I knew those gigabytes weren't worth anything, but damn. Let's go by cost. Let's go by cost. Let's see... Cost-wise, my most expensive cards. There's the invisible wire. 75. Way too much. Still want it, though. So I'm going to put it in another, no matter what. And then we are going to find a card we don't technically need that has a lot of cost to it. Ray's body, he has a lot of cost. We don't need it. And then we can put a low-cost card in. So let's go scroll all the way to the bottom with something that's actually low cost yet still effective. A Yamada Dragon. Oh, whoops. I actually like Yamada Dragon because he's a pot of greed, but he's, he's even too expensive. Damn. Uh, Petite Moth. Oh, I can't even put Petite Moth in. Oh, my God. Um, uh, you want extremely low cost, don't you? What's the lowest thing I have? The lowest of the low- oh, these- oh, we're way past that. Is Boltar Scargo the low- oh, sorry, I keep doing that. It is the, probably the lowest of the low, but I don't want it. Curse Breaker, is that at least something I can afford? It is? Um, it's not that great, but I guess, yeah, for now, for now, for now, just because I want to use this other stuff. Yugi, don't block the only exit, please. Oh god, can I sneak through that? Yes, I can. That was very rude of Yugi. They should not have the path and go towards entrances. That is quite uh, quite silly. Let's go to the Egypt ex uh, Exhibition. Isn't it supposed to be the exhibit? I, I guess I don't care. Do they mean Egypt Exhibition Tournament? Is that what they, they mean? Here sleeps the power of ancient pharaohs. I know ancient power will make me stronger. 
What the f is wrong with this guy? He calls himself the Guardian of Darkness? What's your- What are you, Yami Kuroda? What's wrong with you? <laughs> Serving a Night Shroud, Yami Kuroda? Is that who you're trying to pretend to be? Think you're cool? Well, try beating my Musician King. That's an awesome card to open up with. You can be in attack mode, I don't, I don't care. I have the invisible wire to protect you. Alright, Tomazorus, I'm gonna let you become something as well. You will become a rabbi or a mother can be. Goddess of Wim didn't stand a chance. Musician King goes in. Loving this opening hand. This is great. I had two combos immediately. Two evolution combos. All right, Sinister Serpent is the bait. That was actually a lot of defense. Holy crap. Gorgon Egg is no joke. So I use you as bait and guarantee win next turn. GG. You are not good enough bait, apparently. I'm honestly surprised by that. Wait, that means that you should have no problem beating this monster. Oh, they played me like a god- I didn't think there was any chance they'd have two in their opening hand. They played me like a goddamn fiddle. And now I've taken unnecessary damage. And every damage I take matters. Sleep- The hell is Sleep Child? The hell is Sleep Child? I don't want to know. Queen of Swords, sure. Oh, she's actually good. Yeah, no, I'll take her. I lost, but how? No, I don't duel. You should find someone else. Did a dark big guy come this way? Well, yes. He ran down the stairs. All right, I'll take care of it. Yeah! Sup? You and I, we're going to have problems? You've come for the Millennium Necklace? Yes. Fine, the millenni Millennium Necklace is yours. It is my duty to protect a Millennium Item, for I am the Millennium Guardian. You must prove yourself to me in a duel to see if you are worthy of a Millennium Item. You will only get the Millennium Necklace if you can pass my challenge. Oh, I don't have full life points, but I'll do my best. Oh, this is boss music. Also, I need Harpies if he's going to be playing this much. Uh, with my opening hand, the best start I have is to look for... Yeah, to look for an evolution card. It's gonna hurt. Unless he has a... Raigeki! Okay, and your Fairy Lily, I could beat that. Vansher, I... that had 2k defense. This guy's for real. This guy is for real. These monsters aren't jokes. The only thing that beats that is Shadow, and this loses to Wind. I don't have either in my hand right now. Dark Witch. Oh, I got Dark Witch? I didn't even know it. I didn't notice until right now that I got Dark Witch. Uh, both need to die. I'm gonna... I don't think I run any Shadow Monsters. Let's just kill this one. Let's kill this one just to play it safe. Have Invisible Wire ready in case he gets a Fiend Monster of his own. He already used Raigeki. Luckily, I got his Raigeki for free, basically. But getting rid of Banisher is gonna take a minute. I'm gonna use this opportunity to get more cards. Beauty Lip will be summoned in defense mode. I attack. I'm afraid he's going to have more um, high defender monsters, but let's just hope for the best. Witch Hunt, all spellcasters. I'm, I'm, I'm not a spellcaster, I'm a fairy. Thank God. Thank God I'm a fairy. She's called Dark Witch, but she ain't no witch. Alright, I'll use my effect to search. Just trying to bait out some freaking attacks. I can't bait Banisher, though, unless I'm wide open. I barely beat Injection Fairy Lily. That's wild. This wire gets rid of Banisher of Light. Wait, we got rid of Banisher of Light, why? Light beats Fiend, that's why. Got him, baited him. It was totally worth it. 100% my plan also. Uh, Tomazaurus or Mechan- I think they make the same thing, so let's go with Tomazaurus. Let's get ourselves a Cybersaurus. You know I love this card. All right, we're gonna use this uh, Dark Witch. We're gonna use this Cybersaurus. And life points be damned, we're doing a good job. Bait them into attack mode by using- Oh God, that card, looking at it. Just just don't make me look at it. Holy crap, Beauty Lip. Beauty is right. Pot of Green. Let's see if they get any traps. No traps. We got this. Um, I should just go aggress aggressive and win this duel. I should just go aggressive and win this duel. Doron wins the duel. Yep. Don't play any effects. Just go the hell in. And there we go. We have earned ourselves a Millennium Neck. He was worth 30? Penalty of burning at the stake. What does that even mean? Oh, 
It's Final Flame, but they buffed it by 200. Gotcha. You are still clumsy and unrefined, but deep within you, I sense... I sense? Yeah, I think you meant sense, but nice try. A faint glimmer of hope. You have proven yourself. Take this. It is yours. We have our first Millennium item. What is this? A vision of what is to come. Cities burning. A pharaoh stands alone. Uh, what? I actually don't know how to interpret that anymore. What just happened? That image I just saw. Cooper, you saw it too. Yep. Reshift the dark beam will destroy the world. Stop crying. Oh my god, Yugi. What Ashizu said was really true. And my other self. But, but why? We have to hurry. If we don't, there's going to be a world of trouble. Let's go back. Oh, that's funny because the world's going to die. Gotcha. He's funny. Yugi's funny. <laughs> Whoa. Hello there, new duelist. Huh. So the merry band of losers finally have a clue about what's really going on. Ashizu visited my big brother. She wanted him to get the Egyptian god cards back. Mokuba, keep quiet. The title is champion and the strongest cards. Only the most powerful duelist is worthy of these two things. And that duelist is me. I will recover the Egyptian god cards quick and easy. I bet you guys are happy that my big bro is going to help you out, huh? Honestly, you take the gods, we take the items. It's actually a pretty good deal. Mokuba! What is it, Seto? I have no intention of teaming up with these clowns. Big bro, come on. Listen up, you fools. A real duelist doesn't need a help from a bunch of cheerleaders. All you should count on is your strength. You guys are so weak that none of you can survive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Calm down. Did you not watch Steven Universe? You didn't learn about, like, you know, two is better than one sometimes. You just, you nah. Know, didn't learn about love and fusion. That weakness. This is the Egypt exhibit. Can I duel you? No way, I'm not a duelist. I came here for the exhibit. All right, cool. Oh, well, we're going to head on out of here then. We're going to go back to Clock Tower to heal up our life points. And then we're going to go a bunch, uh, uh, to a bunch of places. We're going to go around and continue to buff up our level for the next uh, part of the game. I guess we could talk to Ashizu and give her back her necklace. She probably wants it. I am glad that you have returned safely. I see that you have obtained the Millennium Necklace. Unfortunately, it is not sufficient. A single Millennium item does not have enough power, not enough to restore the Egyptian God cards from stone. The next Millennium item. Um, sir? What is this presence I'm feeling? Why do you have a clock on your mouth? Oh wait, no, that's a mask, okay. I am the puppeteer of doom. I won't let you meddle with Master Chavalski's plans. Duel. All right, why not? This guy thinks he's tough. Let's see what he can do. Oh, actually a good start, especially with this field. And there's a card that powers up the beauty lips. The hell is happening in this world of dual monsters? All right, got no females, so I'm just going to have to hope that frog the jam is female. Let's go. Didn't work. Damn it. I wanted to use Fraud the Jam to bait out the trap, but I couldn't I couldn't risk being wrong. Summoner of Illusions was one of the ones I didn't want to hit. It's sad that that's the one I got. Beauty Lip is the one I wanted to hit. You're gonna need a hell of a monster. Doron can only stall. Doron stall until I get a female. Basically any female will help in this situation. Ooh, this guy's strong. This guy is strong. He got one equip spell and one con. Whoa, that card's stronger than everything else he's played. Holy crap. Invisible wire is nice, but I'm out of cards. We got we're in a bad spot. This is the power of going first, everybody. I got rid of their strongest card so far, though. Beauty Lip is gone. Or right, doing its thing. I'm running out of life points. I need a female. I have a lot. Okay, whatever. Not good. I need Pot of Greed. I need a female. I need something. Crap, he got another beauty lip for free. I'll barely survive this turn. Alright, let's see what happens. Nope. That is not not a thing. Alright, bad hand. Very unlucky. And they have brain control, which is probably one of the most expensive cards in the game. Very interesting. Okay, so that guy's for real. Uh, we'll deal with that later. <laughs> that guy is for real. I don't need to, uh... 
I don't need to make the mistake of fighting him again. Let's go around and see if there's anyone I haven't fought so I can get some experience, get some better cards. He has brain control for crying out loud. I better get some better cards. Uh, this place doesn't exist anymore. They took Bones' freaking cemetery away. Those monsters. All right, Mokuba. Can I duel you? My big brother isn't here. He's investigating the Millennium items. He said there's another group also looking for them. Oh, boy. Cool, we do get to duel Mokuba. This is my last Hellbound, so I better not lose it. Oh, it's only one of a kind. Whoops. Okay, basic insect it is. Okay, I got my evil ritual, which is actually not good at this moment. Um, I got every one of my cards. Also, this guy played a 1300 attack point monster in the opening play. That's pretty wild. And two traps on top of that. I was hoping he'd go for a tribute, which is why I was saving Fiend's hand. I gotta keep saving it, though. I need something. Oh, god damn it. Alright, we'll use it. I was hoping to use this on a tribute, but screw it. Toon Alligator is not as scary, despite its defense. Will me and Toon Alligator. Let's go. Come on. Give me something good. Son of a bitch. What is happening to my luck stat lately? I, I don't even know. I don't even know what's going on with me. Okay. And they just had a card to break my curse, huh? Alright. It's my last turn. All those traps scare me, but I just gotta hope this will be enough. Cyber? Nope. Nope. Alright, Cybersaurus, just be enough. Don't have a busted trap card. Please don't have a busted trap card. Okay. Cybersaurus keeps us in the duel for now. We're fine. We just gotta fight for our goddamn lives. Okay. Need more monsters. Need more power-ups. Huh. Tomazaurus. Not exactly something I can rely on. But Urubi is something I can rely on. Urbi should have enough attack to be good. Okay, Urbi, you take care of this one. The power of Cooper's dinos, even though one's a machine. Alright, we got rid of the problem so far. They tributed shit. Oh, crap. Interesting. I don't really want to crash, but I am going to crash. And then I am not going to attack directly, because if I lose... My li if I lose the ability to tribute, those traps will probably kill me anyway. Son of a bitch! He got Dark Hole. Okay, Gigabyte. Oh my god. Nope. Nope, that was not the draw I needed. God damn it, that freaking... Oh, that was such a good top deck by him. That was such a good top deck. I might as well try... Try to stay alive. Back in, he's trying to end me right now. It's not enough, but it was close. Okay, I have every evolution spell, basically. And they don't work on this. Son of a bitch. Oh my god, I couldn't do it. I could not do it. It did not work out. Mokuba t defeated me. Mokuba, you are pretty good. Give me a rematch. I don't care if I have to run all the way back over to you. I will get that rematch. Luckily, this is not the... Oh, whoops. Not the biggest area. I feel like I could have won that. I just got an unlucky hand. Not great. Yeah, how did I lose to you? I had basically everything, and then you just dark hold me. I guess that's the question. I got dark hold. All right, I don't have any more bets there. You know, one of my many Tomazoruses. Okay, great trap start, and I could search Metamorph, so that's really good. Uh, just in case, I'm only going to play Bear Trap 1. You never know if he has Harpies. Okay, he has a healing card. He beckons me for no reason, even though it's one of the weakest cards in the game. Grappler stays alive, which I did not like. Uh, let's get uh, let's get a, bowl, uh, a moving. Metamorph, no luck. Alright. I feel safe to use Double Trap, so we'll work our way up. Red Potion heals a lot more. 800. Bear Trap takes down the Grappler, and the other monster's weaker. Interesting. Tomazaurus is one of the best cards I could have gotten, because this is a Cybersaurus, which is one of my most reliable monsters. Oh, it was just a Gigabyte. Whoops. I thought it was just, like, you know, a big defense monster. We've run into a lot of those lately. Okay, Crocodilus was really strong, but we beat it. See, this was a much better starting hand. Holy crap. The difference in starting hand is this strong. Alright, attack for 18. Att 
attack for a K. Attack for 700. Loving it. Good job, Frog Slime. Or Frog the Jam. Yep, it's sad to see a Killer Serpent be able to destroy my monster, but it happens. Uh, funny card to top deck in this moment in time. I attack. I make sure you don't come back. I attack. I attack. And what the hell, I can just go back and heal after this. I attack. 250. Oh, sad to see uh, Frog the Jam go, but it's okay. Sinister Serpent of my own. Cybersaurus goes in. And that is the end. We can beat Mokuba. Just a little rough. Six in ca capacity increase. Not bad. Toon Alligator. You know, with the Toon buffing card I have, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I know. I can beat you, Mokuba, but your brother's a lot stronger. You know, in my show, you're actually not that bad. You're like a mid-level duelist. A decent, stu uh, decent duelist at the school, but if I put you in any high-class tournaments, you'd probably be screwed. Okay, it's always good to save your progress, guys, but I want to see, am I allowed to duel the duel machine like in the last game? And if I'm not, then I'll try someone else. But Mokubo was nice. Hello, th hello there. Okay, cool. Novice level, please. Yes. I'm glad they actually added settings for this thing. Um, I will bet you... I don't know. More Tomazaurus. I don't, I don't care. It is my turn. Doron will split. Alright, not bad, not bad. A respectable start. Me, on the other hand, I'm just going to play a little defense and see what you try to do with a tribute. Okay, that does screw my idea. Doron will split. Amazon Archer ruins a Doron, and Bear Trap kills the other. So your monster advantage has been defeated. Goddess of Whim is nice for its attack stat. So let's start taking out Doron. Well, use you first. That would be way smarter. Okay, thank God. I was going to uh, put you in defense mode to save you, but instead I just want to make sure they have less chances to tribute for a big monster, because I've lost a five god dragon on the first episode of the last turn. Hourglass of Life is horrifying. Even at the cost of their life points, that puts me at a huge disadvantage, unless I draw an evolution. Or that. That, that, that helps. It's not enough, but it helps. It's something. Uh, yeah, I didn't think so. Alright. We'll try something else. We haven't drawn any of our evolution cards. No searchers, no nothing. And a bunch of other duels, that's all we ever drew. Huh. What a weird, what a weird day. That's a lot of back row you got there. I don't think I'm a big fan of it. You know, I don't oft often say this, but I wish I get Dark Hole now. Okay, let's just, uh, do that. You get into defense mode immediately. And you start splitting up, and then we'll... Hopefully get a tribute monster eventually. I put I put more in my deck, right? So should be a thing that can happen. Hourglass is a problem, but as long as I keep a door on. Now we're good. I can't draw any of my evolution cards. Wild. What a world we live in. Alright, I attack you. I wanted to bait out the traps, I guess I couldn't. And Doron attacks you, just to make sure that you don't get too big of a lead on me. Well, that's no good. The type advantage did get me there. National Scientist, okay. A lot of scientists. Yep, that's not what I wanted to draw. I only put that in the deck because of deck cost. Fire Reaper's doing their best. This is terrible. This duel's not going well. I need to draw Metal Morph. I'm out of time to, to go for any other play. Son of a... What is going on with me lately? I am just... Oh, Mousetrap, yep. Would have happened to either of them. Yep, that's the end of the duel. I feel my death a-coming. Oh, Blast Juggler! <laughs> Alright, at least I like that card. Eh, it's not terrible, but it's not going to work out for me. Okay, we'll go into defense and we'll see what happens. They tributed for a monster bigger than Invisible Wire. I'm still in the duel, technically, but it's it's basically over. Kaiser Dragon's insane. Oh, now I get it! At the very last turn, I get my Searcher. That's hilarious. It took so freaking long. All right, yo, yo, I'm still in the duel. I've been holding on for dear life. Here, I helped out. There you go. I played everything I had. I can't beat the novice level yet. We'll be upgrading our deck next episode for sure. 
We definitely have a lot of a lot of kinks in the deck I need to fix, and I will be fixing them. So guys, I want to thank you very much. Please remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye!